the, you have the three cameras, the three P100s, and you save $500 on the keyboard. Or if you get three P200s, you get the keyboard for free. That's a $1,595 savings. So let's come back now. And I just want to stress these are the products we're looking at. And basically, you get three of these or three of these and one of these. However, you know, we're, we're kind of flexible guys. And we'll, if you need to mix and match, you got to call Adam or call Oliver and they'll work a deal with you and we'll get that. Shane, you've used the bird dog cameras. Tell us about them a little bit. So what I found out, and I also wanted to find out bird dog support. They're excellent. He got right back to me and answered all my questions. And I did say, I'm like, hey, I have a lot of questions. I found out that it's simultaneous out. The HDMI, SDI, and NDI, you can have all three feeds at once. So if we're old school and we need an NDI connection or SDI connection, sorry, you can plug in SDI and have an SDI feed out as well as your NDI. So I also dove into their web UI, which is kind of how you make everything communicate. I was up and running in no time. So it's just a you know your basic setting a static, getting into your default gateway and just kind of understanding those two things. And once you have that down, you are up and running, connecting the cameras. The other huge benefit, you know, I've, I've used PTZs for quite a bit. I just never realized that. So a three camera bundle, you can configure with a controller, each camera to two, three, four shots. You now have a six camera shoot, an eight camera shoot, utilizing those three presets from each camera. So the doors have fully opened with this package. Yeah, I'm I, impressed. I, I know one of the verticals that we've seen immediate acceptance of this because we actually launched these online about a week ago, uh, two weeks ago. But we had to wait for the show for when Shane was available. This guy's uh, this guy's working his butt off, you know, trying to sell this stuff. So this was the first time we could get get, get a date that worked for both of us because we do our show on Tuesday, so we had it available on Tuesday. But this is made for House of Worship because you got to think about it. House of Worship. You're going to put one camera in the back one camera off to the side somewhere. And what I really love is I love that camera that's like right in front so you can get that tighter shot of the preacher. And I also don't mind if it's a little up angle because it makes everyone look kind of a little like, ah, you know, lofty and stuff like that. And I really think what you said is really amazing because if I've got that camera off to the side, I can use it as like the way we use this camera as a side view kind of attention cam where I'll go, Hey, I'm going to talk to you about something really serious. So I'm staring right into this camera because it's real important. I like to call this the Gary cam sometimes as a joke when I'm saying like, I'm going to turn and say something real important into this camera. Then I'm going to go back this way and talk. And you could have that be with multiple camera settings. And that same camera could now be turning and it could be facing the choir. And choirs will be back in the churches at some point. And other people will be back in the church. You could turn it. These have 360 motion views. So the one that's up close on the preacher can also be turned around and be showing you the whole crowd. So... There's just so much cool, fun stuff you could do. So 